Ready? Ready? Let's do this. Okay, this is really, really, really awkward. Hi, we're Matt and Mouse and we live on the west coast of Canada. We moved here about 20 years ago, and like many people, we've had our ups and downs over the years, but we've loved every minute of being here. When the pandemic hit, we decided that now was the time to commit to our future plans, have a dream cabin in the woods, and just go for it. This is our story. There must be somebody there saying action. Oh, I have a clapperboard. Mm. I don't know where it is though. Action. Oh. It was just a joke. Thank you. Wow. Thank hey, you. welcome to our YouTube channel. Um, what's our YouTube channel about? It's about our little journey for our little Canadian dream, really, isn't it? Mm. Our plan. We had a little dream once upon a time to have a lovely cabin in the woods. And things happened in the last couple of years that involved lockdowns and new perspectives in life yeah. and changes in priorities and restrictions on travel and things like that. And it made us really think about where we were going in life and looking to plan more for the future. Yeah, we kind of got to that age where we evaluated our priorities and what we want to spend our time, money and effort on. Yeah, and our kids are getting older. We have two kids, teenagers. Yeah, we're that old. Yeah. Um, and yeah, there's going to come a day where they're not living with us anymore. And like, what do we want to do? Where do we want to live? And things have changed so drastically around here, haven't they? With mm. the way we live near a city, a big city. We're not in a city. We're in a city, but not the big city. And all the folks from the big city have been moving out into the suburbs like where we are, raising the house prices up like crazy, making the t our town bigger and bigger. And it's actually an awful lot of people from our area are looking to going more in rural areas, which is kind of like the dream anyway. So we thought now is the time to actually do something like that because if we wait five years then mm. who knows this ripple effect of the real estate craziness might have rippled to where we want to go and what we want to do and we will no longer be able to afford it and we'll regret it and look back and go oh, five years ago we... so it was a case of if we're going to do this now was the time to do it mm. and this housing <clears throat> issue uh if you like for the house prices and stuff it's not just restricted to us it's happening all across canada it's all across the world in different areas and we're just looking to see how can we um best make use of that and how can we you know, basically keep uh moving towards our dream mm. of uh grabbing a cabin by a lake or a cabin in a forest and uh slow moving into hermit life <laughs> yeah we don't like people, we don't like people. anymore no it's odd, when the pandemic happened, it's kind of, you realise there's a lot of people out there that we really don't like, and... This makes us sound really bad. I know. <laughs> I don't like people. We do like people, just... Not, not those all, people? Just not all people. Just not the crazy people. Yeah. So yeah, we just... <clears throat> it was the perfect time to, to look at doing something like this. But the problem is, we're not rich people, so... No. What we're doing, we're doing as we can afford it, when we can afford it. On a budget, on a suit, shoestring, ourselves. D we're yeah. doing our DIYing, as we say we're back DIYing in England. DIYing our future. We're as building we it. <laughs> What's up, dude? That's the dog. What's the problem? But we also want to do it as green as we can. Yeah. Don't we? Yeah. Because um, we do care about the environment and what have you. So we thought, let's just do it. Now, the other question is, why are we doing a YouTube channel and sharing this? 
Yeah, and we, were, we thought long and hard about how do we share this with our family members, and we decided that, well, hey, how about we make a YouTube channel? And then that way our friends and family can watch and be along with our journey and uh, accompany us along the way. But as you can tell from our accents, yeah, we're in West Coast Canada, but we're not from West Coast Canada. So yeah, the vast majority, in fact, in our entire family are 5,000 miles away. So this is just a really easier way to share with them. Yeah. We have our own video vlog. And then if other people want to watch what we're doing as well and join us on the journey. Come on, <laughs> hop on board. Literally was about to say that. <laughs> Let's go. The cabin train starts here. This is ever a good idea. I no. think I need something else in my tea. Yeah. Oh. Another thing you need to know about us. We love a good cup of tea. Tea. Love it. So. On with the show. Doo -doo. <laughs> <laughs> so here's the cool thing. Mandy wanted a catchphrase. And he was going to be like, hey, let's make a cup of tea. No, the catchphrase is going to be. Doo -doo. I know, Gizmo. What's up, dude? It's he awesome. Is it awesome? You want to go outside? Alright. Guess we're going outside.